Hello and welcome back to Kill You 60 Plays. I'm Alex and today we are doing another live stream. Uh, today we are doing the related stuff to Colony Zero. So, sorry Valdi, I don't need you anymore in the party. We need to get Sagiri out. That is not Sagiri. Oh. I do have another ascension quest I can do. Okay. I forget, I forgot the hero. <laughs> it's habit. I haven't done a lot involving her. Uh, but to do stuff with uh, Sigiri, we have to head back to the prison camp for uh, that is all at the front of the area. Uh, appears I'm having small bit rate issues, so those, uh, watching this live alongside me as I stream, uh, just to heads up, um, since I don't know why it's doing that, I may, uh, yeah, for those over on YouTube, though, uh, watching the VOD, you may notice this went up, uh, Friday. Or Wednesday by itself. Uh, that's because I just ended up changing this one we could do with some food. around because of a change in how I have things to do. Uh, due to the fact that we, uh, I am kind of ahead of what I want to do, but I can't do some things just due to uh, my current location in the game. That's the best way I can describe it. Uh, so yeah, uh, this part is, t th this session is today. Uh, Friday will most likely still be the Sigiri, uh, the actual Ascension quest part. Um, this used to be a prison, didn't it? We haven't been, you know, arrested in front of jail, have we? Uh, sorry. It's not like I'm accusing you or anything. It's just the way this place feels, it's really unsettling. But that makes kind of sense. That kind of makes sense, right? I mean, it is prison and all. Ah. So it's the people trying to figure out. Questioning why are they in a prison? I mean, that is a very fair question. Um. Oh, this one's open now. Yep, number 10 has the other one. I'm glad we get to sleep with a roof over our heads and all. But this place is a bit too open considering how few of us there are, you know? As things are now, it's hard to feel at home here. Not that we don't appreciate it, of course. But now that we have our base of our own, it'd be nice to have a few more things around. Okay. I mean, the place did go a bluey so I'm not super surprised but it's also still very open <laughs> I keep interrupting myself sorry for that but yeah so and then Monday I am thinking of doing some a, what is going to be essentially a live stream esque uh video I'm not probably going to stream it. I'm just, it's going to probably be a stand, what would be similar part length and whatnot, but it's just going to be side quests. I'm glad you all managed to get moved in, okay? But there are still some of you who seem a little bamboozled, huh? Prison camp is a suitable residence. 
but the prison environment exerts a certain unconscious toll. A what now? Mental strain. Sleeping in a barrack and sleeping in a prison are different things on a mental level. Yeah. And for extremely wary people like them, the mental pressure is greater. So it's a problem of mental health. I'm really sorry, Sagiri. We should have fought this through more. Failure to anticipate this turn of events is on my shoulders, not yours. Responsibility for the team falls on me, and I'm the one who failed to consider the issues from all angles. That means we're house hunting again, though, doesn't it? Or we could just change it up a little. Change up what up, though? Like, the fact that people feel like they're in jail. If we can make it more, you know, homey, then it wouldn't feel so much like a prison. Is the pro proposal to renovate the prison interior. Nah, nah, nah. This place is huge, yeah? We don't have the resources or labor for a proper, proper remodeling. Proposal. Let's hear it. Colony O's resource, man resource management is overseen by number six. No. Number six is my aide. Nope, number six has used unique distribution channels to source supplies during missions. Number six is likely to know where to source supplies here. Then let's pay hot <laughs> number six of it is it. And, uh, essentially next Wednesday, when, uh, Friday, Monday, will be similar. I'm thinking of probably doing unique monsters. Dealing with unique monsters and any other quests that I end up p picking up along. Well, I, you know, level 20 classes. <laughs> Refurbished the prison. Wait, number seven? Are you serious? Seri seriousness confirmed. Will you cooperate? I'm sorry, number seven, but I can't give this plan my approval. This can only be a good thing for you guys. A lot of resources and labor will be needed to remodel a location on this scale. This won't be possible without relying on outside help. Is that a bad thing? We have to avoid contact with butters as much as possible to keep everyone safe. These fears are reasonable, however. Now, son, remind me, what's Colony O's been doing to the outside world all this time? That is, I... You know how easy it would be to wipe out Colony O without protection from Mobius. But we can stay safe forever if we just look after ourselves and avoid discovery. You must know what I'm trying to say, number seven. Is it really that problematic, number six? Yep. Hello, number ten. What does it say about you? About your cho choosing another form of imprisonment after having been freed? It says that your kind of optimism isn't the answer to everything. If push comes to shove, all of you will take care of things, correct? Who, us? As long as we're allied with Ouroboros, our safety is practically guaranteed. I mean, that's kind of an exaggeration, but of course we do everything we could for you. Even so. Number six, your cooperation would be greatly appreciated. Number seven, I've given my warning. Warning received and acknowledged. Final verdict remains unchanged regardless. All right, then I'll follow orders. Appreciation number six. First priority is sourcing the materials we need. 
I have a guy I can contact, though I have my misgivings. You have a guy? A wandering Nopon who deserted the Nopon caravan. These days, he should be hiding out in Makfa Wildwood. Why is he hiding out? I'll accompany you. Thing number seven, and you will put him on guard. I doubt he'd show himself. Compliance. Negotiations are yours, number six. That's still all the wrong one. Okay. Back to this point again. I see you. Really dealy. Their favorite customer of wheelie dealy. Come in, come in, be welcomed. This is your guy, is it? That's right, like I said before, he broke away from an op on caravan. He trades with anyone who can pay him enough, including unsavory parties such as us. Yeah, and we can we trust him. Nobody has his uses. Really dealy can be relied on to procure almost anything as long as our interests align. Every tool has a use. What can really dealy do for your favorite customer today? We need a few things from you. You need something to improve ambience of old prison complex under Agnes Castle. This gargantuan Undertaking really dealy you smell equally gargantuan profit of foot. Yeah, but can you do it? It impossible. Possible not mean really dealy is refusing. But one small simple condition before deal can be made. Clarification requested. It very useful. Lay it out straight. Special procurement tool of wheelie dealy recently feed by monster if wheelie dealy not get tool back wheelie dealy unable to carry out requests okay so we'll we'll get it back for you sticky fingered gogul somewhere in mock for wildwood Good to add more names. okay a gogul needs to be hunted Uh Hang on. Meaning it's not here, but here. I'm like, why can't I find this one item? Why isn't the quest marker showing up technically right here? Oh, that's not the correct one. <laughs> no problem now. Still fifty five. So not too worried currently. Or then the poison control Kavesi equipment that sits right here. Just swim in the poison pool. Subjugation 
Mystic target discovered. What in the world has that thing been stealing? I'll claim the ether here. Just grab the ether before we get targeted. Now it's time to die. There's the physical and now the ether. Currently not working on trying to keep the other ones available currently. Or working up others to at least 10. I'm still working on a couple to 8 and 9, so with the ability to go to 20, I'm not too worried about class levels currently to force a change. There we go. Having some of those items is probably better. Uh, stop throwing me all the way over there. And you may have noticed uh, for the past couple stream bots that have been more quest based. And some of the streams that have had multiple quests, I have started putting chapters in for those, at least on the YouTube side. Uh, those here on Twitch, though, if you decide to watch the post VOD, you can take advantage of this, too. Uh, so anything here, it'll take me a little bit to go back through every part that I've done because there are 60 parts plus as of this one, 10 VODs, so it will take a bit. Target recovered. Please confirm. Memma, this is the exact item that was missing. All thanks and gratitude. Unable to count fabulous riches without this baby. So do we have a deal? Of course we have a deal. Good, honest Nopon who always keeps promise. Now show quick smart to prison in need of home makeover. We talk detail later. Okay? Guess we should make tracks too, huh, Sigiri? I only needed to do two to the right. Did I? Nope. Speaking of, uh, I should also mention, specifically the last uh, VOD, there will be a uh, card to that. Better let everyone know you're safe and sound. Uh, so you can reach the beginning quest of this area. Thank all for patience. Let negotiation begin. What should we do? Listen to requests and procure necessary goods and supplies. Leave all arrangement to wheelie dealy. All is all expense paid up front in advance. How much are we talking? Five hundred thousand. If no one to pay money, wheelie dealy say bye bye, honey. Requesting permission to pay in installments. Permission granted. Wheelie dealy procure item as payment come in. But 
Wheelie Dealy keep eye on you until payment complete. You're just going to stay here. Keep promise, but making sure others keep promise is good business. I'll keep an eye on Wheelie Dealy. Will that do, number seven? Your constant assistance is appreciated, number six. Don't misunderstand, I'm still not okay with this. But you're our leader, so I'll follow orders. That's all. Number six looks mad. Maybe we were being unreasonable pushing for this. No abnormalities are detected. Current behavior conforms to number six's normal pattern parameters. Oh, really? Number six's opposition serves to protect Colony O. Number six also wishes to the assist the colony. Things you don't understand unless you knew them. I see some relationships. Okay. With that, how much money do I have? I have a million hundred forty-seven gold. <laughs> Thousand gold. I think we're fine. Refurbish. Ah. Ah. <laughs> so you don't have to try. So you don't have to keep trying to grind and just spend money for the parts. But it's still gotcha, so be careful. Now we get down to business. Uh, refurbish. 70,000. I didn't buy many of the, uh, gear because I was just killing monsters that was enough to where I got good gear. <laughs> More equipment. Ah, food supplies. Two hundred thousand. So we're at two hundred twenty thousand currently. Ah. After all, yeah. Thank you for stealing my actual words tie on you. <laughs> but Lons, seriously. Been waiting. 130. Will bring us to 350. 350,000. So the last, for the last one, it will be 150,000. The cells have been updated to be actual living quarters. Upon the unit's request, daily essentials have now been distributed. It's looking more cushy than your average colony now. More cushy than the average colony. Yeah, I bet. 150. Yeah, this is just your average colony. This really is just an average colony. Level 5 is now... Level 5. Nope. <laughs> we are maxed. Wheelie Dealy, I assume you're just Trader Pawn. What to buy? Crit rate by 40. 
Oh, shoot. These are hi very highly priced, but they're so... They actually look fairly good. Hundred percent resistance to sleep. I assume it's probably in the, uh, similar. I can do that. <laughs> Ooh. That's actually... Some of these are actually very fairly priced. Yep. I have a Berserker Summer one. I was just seeing if I've already started killing enemies with these specific enemy types. I have a... I should have the Bunnet version. Some of the... Other versions of the bonnet choker. Uh, chain ring. For each. Ooh. Ah, okay. John's so actually wearing that. That would be why. Okay. Uh, hang on. What to buy? Yeah. So, most of the enemies we're starting the fight are dropping these items. So I don't actually have to look at, uh, hunting these things down. Okay. Okay. Now let's get back on with the quest. Number six. The prison is currently facing a problem we can't afford to ignore. I'm sure that number seven will approach you with the details soon. But either way, at some point we might need to rely on you again. Prison problems. Round two. There are now containers all across the area because screw you <laughs> you're not going to check your map not on coins only issue is Sagiri is going to take freaking forever and I'm not going to look forward to that Ah, that's how you get up there. These two are up here. And this way I can also figure out who's the two better talking. This, this is a gold one. Knowing I mean, Jurok did it. Nope. All pure gemstones. Uh, hang on. We're at 83. Uh. Now nah, I'm just looking at people with classes that are close to being maxed just in general.
No, I think we're good. I think 10 is going to be our next one. Again. Nope. Seriously? Is that there? I think I had the right idea. Nope. Oh, that's where, ah, okay, so we get these last two, well, we have to keep careful with the knock on coins because they're close to max and I don't want to run out of them. Partially why if I'm not grabbing the things. Hang on. Talk to number six. He didn't say anything. He's the one who gave it. Number nine. Still looking for it. And now what? Looking for what? It's your guy's fault for putting me in this awful situation. Just give me some space, would you? Uh, I'm sorry. What did we do? I think she... Did I get it? Let's make the most of our break, guys. Break time's over. Missing one prison problem. Right at the prison recently. Really Dealy was his name. He's adorable. Er, really? It's a dream of mine to live with the Nopon. Okay, I guess. Some relations have changed. Don't get angry with her. That's allowed. There's a second person in here with number six. Number eight. Especially now, the monsters inhabiting this area are a useful tool in keeping us safe from outsiders. But if we continue to let their numbers grow unchecked, then we'll be the ones under threat. It's about time we did something about it. Calling monster problems sure we're well rested. again. But they're the Vogel type, those Vogel type enemies. Monster populations in prison environs. I've recently begun an upward trend. Wonder what's causing that all of a sudden. Variety of possible contributing factors. B. The current lack of prisoners assigned to call the monsters on account of all the prisoners escaping. Oh man, that brings back some rough memories. Prisoners regularly hunted monsters to keep the population down. All that work had an actual purpose. Isn't this pretty bad then? And we're all just sitting around and chatting. In agreement. Such search and destroy missions are planned for 
Colony O2. You can help you out. Many hit hands make like work, right? Prison spring cleaning. Interesting. I'm all refreshed and ready to take on the world. Oh, we're already in Central Hall. Preparations are complete, number seven. Just give the word. Compliance. Mission is to split into pairs and eliminate each monster. In that, remain in close contact with your partner and refrain from engaging in single combat. The pairs will be as follow. Number six and number eight. Number nine and number three. Number ten and number fifteen. That is all. Where is number fifteen? I'm supposed to meet him later. So, it's something about or other about data analysis. Uh, number 15 will be fine. I'll look after him. Acknowledge number 10. Uh, what should we do? We will p monitor the sit combat situation and provide backup for the raiding parties. If this necessary, number 7, I should be able to take down enough of these monsters. Number 7 avoided that thing. Recommended that single combat be avoided. Are you disobeying orders? Did, did I say that? Ugh, you're such a nitpicker, number eight. Number nine, you know the rules. Interpersonal conflict is considered suboptimal conduct. No, shut up, number three. Enough chatter. Get to your positions if there are no more questions. All oh, units board Pharaons. Operation begins now. Commencing operation. Yep, let's take them all out. We're dealing with Ferris the Ferris packs again. Let me guess uh fifty six. The last one was fifty five. This is gonna be fifty six. So I go into borderline fifty seven to fifty eight. They're just areas. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh, this is hurting. Dang, Tyon, you're just dragging all the enemy aggro. Just a little too high for the necessary things. Now, I keep forgetting to make culinary stuff. I did that in Pokemon, too. Hey, number three, what the snuff were you thinking of with that attack just now? It almost hit me, you know. I'm sorry. I think you were going to move in front when I was timing my attack. Excuse me, are you saying I was in the wrong here? It's just... Whoa, whoa, let's break this up. You stay out of it. This hasn't got anything to do with you. Calm yourself down, number nine. Number seven, but... We are currently in battle mode. You must focus on the mission. Understood. Um, number s nine, I um, really am sorry, you know. I have a bad feeling about the end of this set of quests, but I am going to keep that thought to myself.
I'm gonna... Bam, 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 bam. All targets confirmed dead. Understood. Continue to patrol the vicinity. This place should be alright for now. At number 8 by our side, this place will be just fine. Speaking of number 8, he was on point taking out these monsters just now, right? Number 8 is second only to number 7 in terms of combat ability. He follows orders to a T. From a captain's point of view, number eight is the soldier you'd have you'd kill to have in the squad. There's nothing special about following orders. Sure thing, man. No need to be mo uh, so modest. Uh, my bad. I didn't mean to make fun of you or anything. No, it didn't really bother me. And there's his one weak point: getting into misunderstanding so easily. I'm trying my best to resolve that. Relax. That's not. A problem for us at all. Understood. I see some relations have changed. CP twenty six. Lons and Senna will be done. Unity will be five years. <laughs> the more I can put into some of these classes, the better. Then I can just start uh Forcing Nop on coins down all of them for finishing up the leveling of the classes. Get over here quickly. I have a feeling it's only gonna be one. Helping number 10 in those. If I had a class that actually had a uh, topper right now, I'd actually probably be able to launch <laughs> and smash in that exact moment. Seriously. <laughs> Aha, we didn't make things easy for you, huh? Thanks for the help, though. Expressions of gratitude are unnecessary. Helping out comrades is standard operating practice for soldiers of Colony O. Hold on now, where did that other guy go? The one who was fighting with us just now. Oh, you mean number 15, right? He went back to base straight away after we got done with the battle. I would have at least liked to thank the guy. He's a quirky one, that number 15. He's an impatient one too. Give him credit though, he is very intelligent. But tease him and he gets angry quickly, fumbling over his words like mad. He's the newest of the newbies in Colony O, so as his mentor, I like to tease him as much as I... On this please elaborate on this teasing behavior that you've mentioned. Uh, now that I think about it, I'd better be off. Catch you later. Targets eliminated. Mission complete. Good work, everyone. Let's head back. Yep, 
The others must have already been on their way back to the prison, sweet prison. I nearly hit the plus button to run faster. The guys still have bits and pieces of the Rom Romero and Julieta quest line still, so I had to do that eventually. Better let everyone know you're safe and sound. Will you just get with it? Come on. What's that? Number six. What is the reason for this ruckus? Uh, number seven. Just in time. Why do I have to be paired with you? I could use up all the life in the world and it wouldn't be enough to cover your butt. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. And all you ever do is apologize. Do you think that'll just make everything better? Come on, Nine. Rein it in. Free didn't mean any harm. Doesn't matter what she means. The result is the same. She's at fault. Have you already forgotten how Four used up his life? Do you deny that he died because Free was being useless and he had to cover for her? Nine, that's enough. You're going too far. You all know what I'm talking about. One of her own died because number three was too weak. Four was strong and he sacrificed himself for someone weak. Does no one see how stupid that is? Look what happened to number 13. Number nine. Now she's done it. No, sorry, I didn't mean to. This conversation is over, Nine. At least dro and drop the topic of number three, at least for now. Nine. The search and destroy operation is over. All units return to your posts immediately. Sigiri, um, sorry, but I'd ask you not to talk about this now. At least not just yet. Oh, okay. Spring clean is done. Huh? What's up, Smashy? Call me crazy, but I think someone's in there. No particular reaction. Maybe I was I really was imagining things. I see some relations have changed. Okay. Hmm. Is it that still on your mind? Kinda? Uh -huh. Guess once something bugs me, I can't let it go, you know. Hey, is anyone in the Hello? Shut up. Oh my sparks. What the what? What in the world was that? My question is the same. It's a Um, let me check that. Acknowledging feeling. I should write this all down.
Um. I just want to make sure this. Okay, no. The one I need for this one is in the. Is actually right where I'm standing now. Good to know. I just wanted to check that. Okay, I have something else to do there. Just checking to make sure what I have. Remaining. Okay. Huh? Hey, did you guys hear something? Let's Just most of wanted to check what the sets were. Okay. Order food. Mystery Pharaon. <laughs> well, that sure was a surprise. But it looks like you were right, Senna. There was someone inside after all. The person you encountered was likely to have been number 15. Was there a number 15? We haven't met number 15 yet. Must be the one who went straight back home after the monster hunt. Why would anyone get in a Pharaon when they're not fighting, though? The control mechanisms of a Pharaon include an advanced operations processor. Six informs that some kind of data analysis is currently in progress using this equipment. We haven't, ha haven't seen a glimpse of them in all this time. According, according to the information available to me, 15 has not debarked from his pharaon since arrival at the prison. Wow. That just ain't right. There is no cause for concern this behavior falls within 15's normal. Stop right there. This is a huge cause for concern. We have to do something. He's gonna end up a wreck. We'll get him out even if we have to drag him kicking and screaming. Fifteen does not appreciate interference by third parties. You must know that we're not just going to leave this. Was my judgment incorrect? Well, to confirm that, we'll just have to talk to him first. Acknowledged. Number 15, please respond. State your business. 15, there are concerns that spending so long in a pharaon may have adverse health effects. Recommend to depart for a, for a short break. I will once I've reached a point I can pause this operation. Request for estimated time frame. Error unknown. I'm 
positive it will be at a later time. Will that be all? I, um, acknowledged. Right then, I'll return to my task. There's not much one can say to that. Seven, what's wrong? Uh, three, it got number three. That voice. Fifteen, you're shut away in there again. Are you getting plenty to eat? Have you washed? Do you have a change of clothing? None of this is your concern. I can do what I want. It is my concern, though. Don't you know everyone's worried about you? Look, the mission's over, isn't it? You're really bugging me, so just leave me alone. The rules say do not address others in a cruel manner. I just... Fifteen, please. All I'm asking is for you to show your face from time to time. If you don't and something dreadful but hypothetical happens, then you might die all alone in there and no one will know a thing. As if that would ever happen, but... Just shut up. Alright, you know what? Fine. You win. I'll get out of this thing. You will? Really? Are your intentions truly honest? Quit repeating yourselves. And seven, since I'm totally doing this under duress, you need to help me with something. Compliance, what do you require? I need Ouroboros over there too. I wasn't lying before. I really can't stop this now. This data is essential and a gap will cost, result in huge costs in terms of processing time. Skip to the end. Dumbass Norm. <laughs> Seven, I've designated some hostiles you need to suppress. Bring me the combat data from your Pharaon when you do. I've sent you the list of targets, the data collection plugin. Compliance, confirming receipt. Okay, so, no for the love of parks. So, that means go with seven and beat up some bad guys. Compliance. <laughs> okay. And this is definitely on the higher level. 57s? Oh, this helped. Man, am I glad I did this during Monica's quest. <laughs> At the end of the last part. <laughs> At the end of Monica's uh, hero quest. Sorry about that. But that one I equipment I should have started trying to equip as soon as I read what its effect was for boosting art should have been put on one of the tanks to just keep the tank to keep uh, there we go I'll claim the ether here. only have to Take out the two. Yeah, I needed Aoife. Oh, the nutrition bar I should have actually eaten, actually. How are you already almost dead? Mio. Might swap to Mio just to heat get her to get back in that freaking circle. And there's the reason.
There we go. Ooh, new amulet. Almost back to being that full for this. You can never go wrong with some ether. Huh. Okay. Oh, is it specific areas? Ammoni and Eclipse Marin. Marins? Or here. Shut in, shut in. Oh. Before I do anything, um, characters interlink. SP-241. Okay. You found power. There we go. That's definitely the one I wanted. <laughs> Let's just boost his damage to ungodly potential. Nope. 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 Just checking through just to make sure. Yep. Yeah, nope. Can't do anything here. Needs 160. Or uh, at least 210. Oh, hang on. Where's my, uh, art canceling one? Just remembered that. Cleared both of these. A new power, eh? Ooh, sacred cannon. A we mo oh, I should have. Oh. Ninety five plus eighty five is one eighty. Yeah, I should. Oh. Well, I have no more. Well, I have Mobius, but not more Mobius in the current moment. Eighty-two, eighty-two, eighty-five, eighty-five. Yours is weird. That's two thirty. Check out this sick new skill. Check out this sick new skill. And here's where all his are. He has all these like 40 and 90s at the end of his skill chain <laughs> tree. And then Senna. Whoa, new power. I have to reach 190 now. And I saw this one just sitting back here. That needs to update. Okay. Okay. Marins, Marins, Marins. They are in weird spots. It's about time, though, I started hunting these things.
The Geary's model is the weird one. When it comes to combat. Because the class, the actual character class or Boros gets is just them outside of the fair is what they look like outside of the fair on. Better than the fair on. But you get the axes from the fair on. And it fits in, right? And then you have Sagir the hero it's too, and it's like, seriously? I don't know if Marins are required for any of the other ones. If only you didn't charge off on your own. Next one is up here to the left. And while we're here, I'm going to take out one extra creature. Maybe. Maybe not. If I remember. Hey! You're an Eclipse Marin. Uh... What's this? Pull him. Pull him. Okay. I should really have break on him. Okay, time for it to die on the ledge. And... Doom. Mio. How did you not die? Nope. I sh had a feeling there was an issue with it. Apparently, unique type versions of Eclipse Marons do not count. What the? Apparently, elite enemies do not count for this fucking run. <sighs> what in the ever loving. Nope.
Oh. What in the living crap is this? <laughs> I lost to a low 24 because I randomly got the blowdown effect and fell straight down to my death. By the way, everything else in combat doesn't hurt you in, when in Ouroboros, but fall damage does. How? Unless it considered me outside of Ouroboros because the battle end would have ended as soon as I hit the ground. Which is BS. Apparently there's one down here too. Or something. Give me the container. So the things are just where the guys can spawn and not exact actually where they spawn. Yeah, and there I go trying to clear out the fight fast and nope. And I'm surprised the Capiba that had been sitting here was not dead yet. Don't think I've ever done that fight. Deal with the raptor first. Then deal with the Marin. Hello Ansel. You're dead. I'm angry. Thank you. That was spectacular. And I was the MVP. You're all thinking it. Come on.
Yes. And the thing I'm supposed to try and kill right now. Apparently there's one more on this side. Hopefully it's within draw reach. Uh, halfway. Tyon's almost done with Gunner, so I'm not the Gunner, so I'm not too worried there. Yeah, I can also then start building him without use of... Might be so far freaking high up. That one isn't, though. Oh, yay! They're just running now. Because seriously... They put all these things in... Freaking god awful areas to actually try and use lore for. Over here. There we go. Rolling smash. If only you didn't charge off on your own. Finally. The enemies are at least easier. Um, okay. How do I get there? Let's warp to Gava Junction and figure out what I'm supposed to do. I'll deal with that at a later date. Hmm. Thing I need to do is get back down to the standard old area of this region. But I have a feeling I have to come both somewhere around here to do that. Nope. Uh... Maybe this will help me.
Ah. Okay. Right location, wrong area. And of course, nothing actually comes close to this spot. Dilemma rock, okay. But this is supposed to be the high level hundred. I predict Gamma it could be an Iota soldier for all I know depending on how long ago that was the Queen oh no that's still Gamma okay Ow. Oh, this might be the cliffs. This section feels like the cliffs of Morifa. Of how steep that area is. The can so the black fog is to continue the time slowly moving ahead. Ah, level 60. The Vogel is going to... As I thought. He, that one's low 100. I gotta die some more. It, yes. Okay, thank Christ we avoided that. There we go. Max rank. That was pretty much what I expected. I say okay.
Anybody else I'm currently working on increasing for him? Okay, I don't have that one. Uh, Soaring Tempest. That's fine. Um. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, no, you don't have Power Cross because you're not leveled in that. Um, Grumpy. Uh, actually, hang on. It's multi blast. Uh, E for skill, don't need. Oh, don't have that either. Hang on. Where's the pierce? Nope. <laughs> this should be good for right now. There we go. Hope that that one was the standard enemy and not a elite. Oh, and elites don't work for this. I forgot. I think it's the only time that uh, I don't know if or I've never really paid attention if elites work for other uh monster quests and if they do this this one's weird it almost feels like this one was done first and then brought up oh, forgotten about oh yeah we have like three launches now it's only until uh This build is only until, uh, until Uni gets, uh, her class finished. And I still forgot to do, uh, the CP boost. Oh, I was gonna change No Love Lost to, uh, the... DLC classes break art. Oh. 
Well, that's also something <laughs> that I f failed to mention. Potentially, <laughs> uh, next part session might not be anything if I don't finish this other stuff. Oh, someone survived. Oh. <laughs> I forget Sagiri's technically number seven, but we just call her Sagiri. <laughs> number 15. I'm listening, just go f going for your combat data. All dummy reactor operations normal, output coefficients converging within normal parameters. No abnormalities found. Let me just double check. He had. Yes, yes, fine. I'm coming out. Here you go. I'm out. As ordered. Happy now? Happiness confirmed. 15. The sight of you looking so healthy is a relief. Is something weighing on you? Nothing. I just never knew you could be so concerned for others. That is... Well, whatever. It's nothing to do with me. I need rest now. Wake me up when the rations are prepared. Excuse me. Seven. Permission to sigh and resignation. So it's just, I was wondering, what you're actually so busy with inside the Paragon? How to explain in a way normies would understand. I'm scanning for irregularities in the dummy reactors of all Paragons. The dummy reactors serve as the replacement power source, okay. And their creator, the one and only number 15. So, you're the one we have to thank for the Pharaons being operational again. Well, I won't lie, I had to slap these together pretty quickly. Running them is kind of risky. <laughs> but without Pharaons, we won't be able to engage in combat. And that's why I had to adjust them quickly and guarantee that the power supply was adequate. If they failed during battle, we'd be dead for sure. But you have been working constantly to support us, so this does not occur. You have my gratitude, 15. It's it's not like that. I just don't want people to die because of my reactors. Real convincing, mate. If you don't need me for anything else, I'm kind of pooped from pulling an all-nighter. So, of course, rest well, number 15. And that's another quest done. And now we have this one in the middle of the hallway. The thing, this is not the Ascension quest. Hey, you there. What is it? Is something up? What were you doing with number seven? Not with Sagiri. Why are you so evasive? It's so annoying. And also, I can't stand to look at you. Whoa. Stay out of her business. You don't even know us, got it? Yes, okay, I'm sorry. I think I made her angry, but I have no clue how. I don't think anybody understands if they've made her angry. Senna and number nine. Let's just order it just to have it within Manana's cooking repertoire later. This has me raring to go. Crumble Crunch Block Bar. So that's a new recipe then. I had to go back through and make sure I have all those. <laughs> Let's lay out the facts. Hey Senna, did that nine have some beef with you or something? What? How did you know? Wait, you didn't see us, did you? Frankly, everyone knows. You do something to piss her off? Well, oh, I didn't mean to. We'd never had a proper conversation before that. Speaking of nine, I remember her, her arguing with her comrades when they were trying to call the monster population. In that case, maybe she just has a short fuse or something. You think? I have a feeling there's more to it than that. I'm sure they're all, they all have their reasons we shouldn't get too involved. But it's bloody awkward to leave misunderstandings unresolved, especially seeing how she can be so openly hostile. I agree. I think we should try talking to her again and bring it up subtly. Fully replenished. Moving out. 
That's someone what happened to number nine. Well, back to the hallway to talk with number three. Um, excuse me. Who are you again? Sorry to bother you. I just wanted to talk to you about, um, about number nine. Earlier, you and nine, um, oh yeah, I guess I really so riled her up somehow. This might be rude of me to say, but please don't think badly of her if at all possible. She's been really on edge lately, though I don't know what about. You mean she wasn't like that before? No, she wasn't. Do you have any idea if something happened? I don't know. I thought of trying to ask her, but I was scared she'd only blow up at me. Hey, if you don't mind me asking, could you help us try and make up with her? You want me to help? Bet we can fix whatever she's worried about, and we'll be able to fix the whole misunderstanding with us, too. You want to get along with Nine again, too, don't you? Yes, of course. If I can help whatever's bothering her, I'd... I'll do my very best, but what can we even do? Um, good question. If three knows that nine has been acting off, the others must have too. Why not asking them for input without letting nine know, of course. Tyon? What? We're already involved to some extent. It's too late to back out now. Well then, let's go with Tyon's idea for now. That's alright with you, Senna? Yeah, sure. Let's get the ball rolling. Wait. Three, wanna come with us? Affirmative. I see some relations have changed. Number eight. Nine, you say? She's gotten more antagonistic than before, for sure. Yeah, do you know why? Eight, hey, you work together pretty often. Hmm. Try the camp at Cap to Corn Peak. Oh, that's why? When we were there, Nine went on way more patrols than she needed to. Now that I think about it, it wasn't like her at all. Maybe something about that place was weighing heavy on her mind. That's about when she started becoming more aggressive. Or, well, she's always been kind of like that, but she does ha seem to have gotten more emotionally unstable. I don't know what it was, but I'm sure something must have happened to her. Can't go right up and ask her, so there's only one thing we can do. Check out the scene. You mean leave the prison camp? You don't have to do all that. Don't worry about it. We'll protect you. That's not what I meant exactly, but thank you. You're so kind. Back to the peak! I have to remember which way I'm going. Ah! The map changes right on that hill. Okay. Cool to know. Ah, it's still, had I known I would have just gone to the frickin' camp, I had a feeling it was somewhere in that other area, not necessarily the... The old base. Ah, this has become an area of grebels, along with a unique. Huh? 
What's an Aussie's flute doing in a place like this? Ah, uh, that's Nine's flute, no doubt about it. How do you know that? Well, if you look closely, the tip has a Nine carved into it. Nine always puts a Nine like that on her belongings. Even on her pharaon? Um, yes, only where no one can see it, though. Do you think she's been looking for the flute, then? Maybe she couldn't find it and had to go off to the prison camp without it, and that's why she's so off-kilter. Nine, why does she even have an austere flute in the first place? That thing's done for anyway. Someone battered the crap out of it. I'm sure she'd blow her top if we showed this to her now. You might be right. Either way, let's try and get it fixed before we go and give it to her. You think it can be fixed? I heard there's an expert instrument craftsman when I trained at Kevis Castle. I think the cat craftsman might still be in Forto Verbis. Let's go and find out. Uh, Noah. Not to hamper your parade, but... Uh, you sure the craftsman isn't... Gone? Like, just saying. <laughs> it's not like I mean to be mean about that, but it's like... I feel like he may have passed, Noah. That is the most fantasy name for a breast bot in I've ever seen. Propofian... Castle. But the castle would always stand no matter how many assaults from Agnes it took, but it ultimately took was a small squad of soldiers. These Ouroboros are on another level compared to us grunts. Interesting. Giddy giddy. Okay, it's a knob on. That makes more sense. Mama, and who might friends be? Are you the craftsman named Giddy Giddy? We have a request for you. Oh ho, a friend is off here. Want uh, their new flute? Um, no, actually, we wanted to ask if you could fix this one here. Me sees, me sees. Let Giddy Giddy take a little look. What items am I gonna have to grab? This flute suffered from tremendous case of battering. Can you not fix it then? Giddy Giddy can fix whatever Giddy Giddy puts mine to. However, it would be much faster j to just make a new one, meh. Yes, well, we figured, but... You don't mind, please. Could you just try and fix that one? Well, if friend insist on insisting, Giddy Giddy will be do his best. Friends must bring Harmony Ebony to fix this flute. Extremely precious timber, findable in Makfa Wildwood. For men such brokenness of flutes are in no way but use natural glue made of harmony ebony resin. Okay, got it. We just need to bring that something to you. When it is found by friends, bring back to Giddy Giddy. Okay. Seize that you found harmony ebony. Without fur one more ado, Giddy Giddy shall begin the repairing. Mamma, rep reparation complete. Glossy and good as new. Thank you so much. No need for mention, but next time please to take care of better care of instrument. Okay. I think it helps that the item that they looked for was the was an item that hadn't been used in another quest. But it's definitely on the lower level so you probably wouldn't have picked it up if you tried doing it now let try doing it earlier i should say hmm. um hey number nine what did you have nothing better to do than pile in on me just to give me lip no of course not we just wanted to give you this. Uh, my flute, where did you find this? 
It was at the site of her old camp. You've been looking hard for it, haven't you? No, nope, well, yes, but you see, I... Wait, what? It looks kind of prettier than it was before. It was broken when we found it, so we fixed it before returning it to you. Uh, was that the wrong thing to do? I... And are you mad at us? Am I mad? Of course not. You're the one who should be mad. I treated you so badly. I said so many mean things to you. Don't you hate me for that? And yet you did this. What? Why do you say that? Of course I don't hate you. Free. I'm sorry, so you're mad at me after all. Don't be an idiot. You've done so much for me. What is there to be mad about? Hey, Free. What is it, Nine? I'm sorry for ripping into you all those times. And thanks for fixing my flute. I'll make sure I never lose it again. Nine. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. This conversation's over. Bye. So oh, glad that went well. For sure. Hopefully that resolved her misunderstanding with us too. Uh, I'll only say this once. Our beef is totally different. So don't you dream we're good now. Seriously? Don't get your uh, up yourself just because number seven likes you a little. Because seven belongs to us. So don't go getting the wrong idea. <laughs> what the? Why this? Hey, was that angry? Because to me it looked more like... Yes, I think she was just plain jealous. Contrary emotions. Nine split. Ah, Wheelie Wheelie has a, another thing, and I see six there as well. Or nine. Wait a second, don't you think this is a bit steep from one measly sweet? All due respect, stocking fee can't include it as standard. If desire is haggle, Wheelie Dealy are happy to accommodate. And quit. Antiquity? And it's supposed to be a reference to antique that valued customers collect. That was just our job, and we got rid of them ages ago. Really, dearly look forward to next visit. Zero's duties. Fix. That sparking tent, I warned her not to up and leave the camp like that. Eight's supposed to be on guard. How on Ionios did she get past him so easily? This sounds pretty serious. We could do with some food. Probably requires Sagiri. Yep. I think we need to discuss this. Hey Sagiri, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Yes? When we were searching for relics, what exactly were you and your friends doing there? Relics? Hypothesis, are you referring to Mission Silver 509? Um, probably. Recovering relics related to the civilization of the Old World was one was a further one of Zero's main duties. That's the Old World. That is what... Console F used to call this world before it fell into the present war. Furthermore, we are we're under strict orders to prevent either Kevis or Agnes from discovering them. That is because the relics were fought to contain an element dangerous enough that it could bring an end to the war. Are you messing with that? What's the spark were you recovering? Waste matter with no clear use. Paper like carbide materials, stone objects of unclear model type. So just a bunch of rubbish then. Yeah, most of the relics we came across were like that too. We were instructed to immediately dispose of any we came across, so I lack clear data on them. So they're shrouded in mystery. This just got kind of interesting. Identification and disposal of the relics was mainly not eight's responsibility. I suggest inquiring with eight about the details if you're so inclined. Let's see. ask eight if we have the chance. Acknowledging feeling. 
this is the last remaining one. To so to do uh for uh the next uh for Sigiri's uh hero quest ascension. Need something? Well um it's not very important, but Sigiri told us you were in charge of collecting relics way back when? Ah. You found something similar, so I thought we'd pick your brains if you don't mind. We destroyed whatever we found right on the spot, no exceptions. Really? That was the job. There's nothing else I can tell you. I don't know anything else. I see. Well, that does suck, but no worries. Why are you asking about this now? No big reason. I guess I was just curious. You were curious? Is that really all? Yeah, no ulterior motives. Understood. Follow me. Wait a second. Don't speed off like that. There's something I want to show you in the storehouse. Okay. Queen's cast. This guy is a mystery to me. I wonder what he wants to show us. Me too. Let's follow him and find out. Hello. Um, right here. Over here. Seriously? What is this? A super pe dirty piece of wood. So this is what you wanted to show us? This is apparently a painting. It is one of the relics I recovered. A painting. Wait, what? Hey, hold on a minute. Didn't you say you destroyed all the relics? According to Consul F, this painting depicts a threat to the world. Threat to world order. Then I was ordered to dispose of it, but it weighed on my mind. Wonder what this painting must depict to make the Consul tell me all of that. So I went and uh, kept the painting hidden behind closed doors. You little thief, I'm taking a shining to you now. Now I see. You wanted to know if we were going to prosecute this indiscretion of yours. The only other person who knows this is here is number 10. Since I hit it, 10 has been looking for ways to get it fixed between missions. Recently, we pinned down the location of someone in the city who may have the means to repair relics. In the city, you say? Indeed, I need to send this to 10 in the city, but I was wondering if you'd do it for me. Thus, why can't you take it there? Six ordered me to guard the camp, so I can't leave my post. Well, aren't you a conscientious worker? I guess I don't mind taking it for you. You have my gratitude. Now, Ten tried to blend in with the city, pe uh, city, si with the people in the city. First, you must link up with her. Got it. Then we just hand over the painting, right? Yes. Hmm. Is there anything else you wanted to say? I do not know if this is suitable compensation for this favor, but. If the painting comes back fixed, then I promise I will show it to all, you all. Ah. I, I wonder what this idea. painting will be. Now I'm curious. Because the last mission we did was writer's... That is related to this one was writer's block. And writer's block was already interesting. So whatever this painting is has to be important. It looked like a picture of the founders, maybe. Because it looked like there were six shadows. That's number 10. You couldn't probably tell me the difference between her and some of the city folk. Oh my, what's going on here? What have you all popped up for? You're here in Nate's place. By the way, what are you wearing? Oh, this? It's Colony O's stock disguise for use when going undercover. I'm surprised that your colony had military uniform disguises in stock. Uh, yeah. Anyways, I assume Nate has caught you up on the situation. Yes, we're all caught up. Here, we brought the painting just like we were asked. Roger that. Okay, then. Follow me. Where are we going? To the person who can fix it, of course. 
With the esteemed Ouroboros lined up behind me, I'm sure nothing can go wrong. That's a lot of optimism there. Well, all we can do is press on. Let's go. Oh, I'll guide you there. After me, please. How fast are you gonna w- Ten! Seriously, ten! Hyon's walking faster than I am currently. The Pharaon's going faster than I am. Now I'm going about the same speed as 10. God. I'll get to that shortly. Probably within the next video or so. Because I'm curious on that quest. God, <laughs> I'm just holding it slightly. Is it Mr. Salmon? Ah, Leanne! From the, uh, if I remember correctly, she was the original quest giver of the writer's block. Hello there, kids. Fancy running into you like this. And what's going on here? Oh, you already know each other? Mega. Looks like I was right to bring you along. Painting repair person? Leanne, we know was. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. Just watch and listen. Excuse me. I have a request for one, Miss Leanne. I've never seen you around before, kid. What's your request? Before you became a novelist, you restored relics to preserve the city's cultural history, right? Oh, that takes me uh, back. That was ages ago now. You've got a good memory. Why do you ask? I was actually wondering if you could mend my relic. Here, take a look. Oh, oh, oh wow. Look at this. This is a fine specimen you got here. A painting. It looks immeasurably valuable, but it's rather damaged, I'm afraid. Do you think you can fix it? Well... It won't be straightforward, but I think I could give it a crack. Why don't you walk us through it? First, I can remove all the dirt with, from it with a special solvent. Then I'll need the same paints and tools to restore the faded parts. If I get my hands on the p solvent and pigments, then I'll give it my best shot. Uh, enough yet. <laughs> uh, I mean, thank you very much, Miss Leanne. Don't mention it. I'm just happy that you youngsters still have some interest in cultures these days. Where can we find these things you need? Matessia resin I need somewhere from for the solvent. Should be somewhere in the wildwood. <laughs> As for the paint, seven hue seashell. That will be a Otto's in the Condensia region have been known to sort such shells. Seven huge seashell, find where the autos are. I'll stay here and look after the painting, sorry, and thanks. See you later, gang. Yep, yeah, you'd best be 
take good care of it. We don't want anyone else to steal it. <laughs> Let's do the kid. Ah. Uh. Cadencia region. We have to come here. This mess of an area. Hang on, I just thought of something and I think the bravery is back to what its original design is. <laughs> Which is the junks. <laughs> Oh no, the junks actually had wings. The autos are over here. What in the ever loving? Huh? I wonder if I was supposed to wait for these guys to do their... Uh... Ow! I had a feeling that's why I equipped this. <laughs> oh, when did the level 60 come in? Merciless Pursuit. Why are there no landmarks here? Like, Jesus Christ. Why aren't there any landmarks? Like, why? There's this one. And then there's the elevator. Nowhere else. Is there a reason for this? Is it just to screw with the players? No problem now. Sitting behind a f elite monster? That is. Yes. <laughs> I say it as I completely get it done. But why the painting? Unless the pharaons are related to. Maybe it has something to do with specifically Colony Zero. 
would be my best guess. Now here's where you have to play the Picross mini game. <laughs> Did you bring everything? Time for me to show my stuff then. Bear with me, it's been a while. How long do you think it will take? It won't be done right away, that's for sure. Of course, of course. In other words, I shouldn't just stand here waiting. I will stand here on standby. I'll bring the painting back to the camp once it's finished. Okay, we'll head back then. In that case, mind helping me carry all this to my workshop, young lady? Yes, ma'am. I like how she didn't even bat an eye. Oh, uh, hello. Did you miss me? Welcome back. You must be tired. Where's the... My word, are you impatient? I'll get right to it and show you then. Hmm. That's... Uh... So this is what made Console F call it a threat to the world order. I don't really get it. I was imagining something much nastier. Those children look so happy. They look like they all get along so well. Yeah, it makes me feel all warm inside. What a... Night, kind and tender scene. Yeah, it doesn't look so bad to me. Oh, what's wrong? I... Oh, dearie, are you crying, eight? Tell me this, ten. What exactly is the point of Colony O? What sort of question is that, and why all of a sudden? Were we fighting to just to erase their existence from the world? Was our mission just to destroy the happiness of whoever's in this painting? Can we really just excuse such a horrible thing? Hmm. No, oh, eight. Did Colony O, did we even need to be born at all? Hey, now hold on. It's okay, eight. You don't have to worry about all that. But ten. It may be true that... Destroying these things was the only way we could live, but from now on, we're going to protect things instead. The world and its people. Kids like them, all of it. We can protect them. You think we can change from how we've been until now? I think so. I mean, just look at Seven. It's obviously you can. I see. So Seven has been doing this for us all this time. I think I understand why Mobius thought this painting was so dangerous, at least a little bit. Yeah. It's very obvious. Oh, I almost forgot. Miss Leanne kindly gave this painting a name for us. A name? What do you mean? Apparently, all paintings you have to have a title. Though usually the original artist comes up with it. Ooh, I see. Well then, what name did Leanne give it? Um, okay, well, I don't really get what it means, but she called it siblings. Hmm.
Interesting title. I'm trying to see if these characters are a reference. <laughs> Um. The right guy looks like it could be Ryan, while the leftmost one could be Shulk. At least references. Hang on. The guy on the right also appears to be wearing armor made out of uh, Ferranus material. Almost remind it kind of reminds me of what the original art style of that was supposed to be. Uh, the original Xenoblade One art style that the Weep <laughs> had some issues with on the character model. <laughs> I'm not gonna say the art it was it bad. I think the texturing on the models was the horrible part there, <laughs> and that did turn me off from playing the game. But anyways, that is going to be it for today's stream uh Nimvod as I mentioned uh, uh the actual ascension quest will be uh Friday this week so look forward to that um and next week I am thinking of probably doing an ascension uh uh, on Monday through next, the following Monday, it's good to keep a record. Uh, I shall be going through essentially level, character leveling, uh, doing spare sub side quests, um, class building, the works. Oh. This is the wrong, uh camp area rest spot I was going to check what levels I can go to if I were to do the level up right now sure we're well rested. max level according to the character list is 80 that is the second high which would put us in range of the second highest leveled uh, unique monster that I know of. Break time's over. Or second and third place ones, which are the Darbus type enemy at, in the uh, Elgar's deaths right here. Uh, and technically here in Cadencia region, there was that, uh, high level 81. Obviously the highest one is the level 100. But that is going to be it for this session. It's good to keep a record. And next time we meet, uh, we have every, uh, well, I say this. We'll have every rank. Oh, no. I know exactly what we're doing. Uh, well, we're going to do some quests uh, in, on the Monday one. But we're going to be hitting a lot of the high Ether Cylinder spots to try and finish rebuilding the Eno Swap. I say this. I still have a number. I've hit a couple, but they technically respawn, so I'm not too worried about doing that on screen, but in case people want to know, I'll show it. Some of the higher ranking spots. But anyways, that is it. As I mentioned, that is going to be it for this stream and VOD. 
I hope everyone enjoyed it. Um, as mentioned, uh, Friday will be Sekiri's Ascension Quest. Uh, to finish off the at least playable character Ascension Quests. Uh, the base game uh, hero Ascension Quests. Uh, and then Monday will be uh, a mixture of doing quests and hunting some, you know, swap part, you, you know, uh, HD cylinder uh, things for, you know, swap. But anyways, thank you all so very much for watching and stopping by. Uh, stay safe. Uh, hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And I shall see you all next time for more. Xenoblade Chronicles. Bye.